Hey everyone, and thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. This video is about a recent uh, purchase that I made from SimplyBee.com. Um, I went to SimplyBee.com for some plus size fashion. Um, if you guys have watched my channel, you know it's been a while since I've actually done a video at all, like a year. Um, and there are some great reasons as to that. Excuse my voice, I'm sick. <clears throat> but um, Basically, um, I've gotten a new job. Um, I worked for a big bank now, I work for a smaller bank. Um, and so I needed some business clothes, um, but that were still really fashionable and not so boring and humdrum like Lane Bryant. Um, even though I love their store because I practically wear everything, like I pretty much am Lane Bryant's poster child. But um, I needed something else. And so I was looking online, looking, searching, searching. Um, for something online and I came across the blog, um, well, I came across, I came across something in InStyle Magazine. And InStyle Magazine featured a plus size edition with some girl named Gabby Fresh, GabbyFresh.com, and she talked about Simply B. And that's how I was introduced to the UK based website. So let me just, just give you that background information. Um, so this was my first purchase. Um, um, this is the, well, you don't need to see my address, but <laughs> this is, um, you know, everything. I did go to Simply B, and I really did spend uh, $184 on three items. Um, <clears throat> I thought it was the best idea because of the fact that, um, because of the fact that uh, they, the day that I went on this website, they were having free shipping and 20% off everything that you purchased so it's coming from the UK I don't know how expensive that would be and I wanted to kind of try it out I hate online shopping <laughs> because I'm a big girl if I was smaller it would be easier but I'm a big girl I'm not skinny by any means and it's so hard for me to figure out and decide if I need to go up a size if I need to go down a size and I was looking online, and I wanted to give you guys an honest review, try to help you, because I looked online, I didn't see that many for this particular website, and I wanted to answer some questions that I was asking that I wanted someone to answer for me. So the first thing I want to say, um, when you're buying anything online, you need to, need to, need to measure yourself. Measure yourself, measure your bust, measure your waist, and measure your hips. <clears throat> If you need help with doing that or you need to figure out how to do it, there's tons of ways to do it online. There's plenty of how-to things on here. You need to know those. You need to know your right measurements. You need to kind of get an idea, okay? So um, for, just so you know, if you do shop at Lane Bryant, I am a true to size for the most part in 1820 at Lane Bryant. Um, normally, I wear um, 1820 pretty much everything. Um, and sometimes a 1416 trouser if it's the... Um, more of the elastic band uh, style, or if any type of elastic band, um, I'm more of a 14, 16, but jeans, things like that, I'm tr a true to size 18, 20. Um, now, sometimes I have to go up a size because I have uh, really, you know, I have big arms. Even when I was smaller, I always had an issue with my arms. So, but just so you know, if you do shop at Lane Bryant, I am an 18, 20 on, on Lane Bryant, okay? Um, <clears throat> so, I bought three pieces. Um, I bought a really pretty spring skater dress, um, a blazer that was shown with it, as well as a pebble on top. I've been wearing the pebble on top forever, so I, I did that. So let me just show you the pieces I got. I do have them prepared. Um, um, the size is not on here. The simply be, I mean, it does not say my size on here, but. Um, on the actual page, it lets you know that I got a size 22 in the coat. I got a size 22 in my peplum top, and I got a size 20 in the dress. This is the dress. <clears throat> and you can see the... Uh, um, Completed detailing and the uh, little thingamajiggers on the side. Now, this should still be on the website. It actually is on the website right now. 
Um, this is not really doing it much justice. Um, it's more of a peachy tone if you look at it. Um, it's more of a peachy tone when face to face. It looks, I don't know how it's coming up. It's looking kind of, kind of almost true to color on here, kind of, sort of, not really. Uh, the sun is kind of going in and out, so like the sun is going in and out, it's kind of making it hard, but that, that's the, the um, thing. Um, now, when I tried this on, <clears throat> this was a 20. <clears throat> it was a little bit big. So I could have done, um, I could have gotten an 18, and it probably would have fit snugger. Um, I really wanted the skater dress to fit really snug on me, and then I wanted the, the skater, the coat, to kind of fit more wide. So the dress kind of fits a little bit, a little looser than I would have liked. So um, I might start to do some more research on possibly getting it tailored, getting it brought in a more true to size. Um, I might make the investment for the first time ever, and I'll let you, if you guys want to know how that works, I'll let you know, and get this taken in a little bit so it can fit me the way I wanted it. I wanted it to fit tightly within my torso area, and then I wanted it to spread out more. And then, um, so yeah, this was a, a, a size 20, and this was a little bit big on me. This is a jersey fabric. That's really important for you to know. Um, online, things that give for us big girls are jersey fabrics, knit fabrics. If you get those kind of things, if it's jersey, you can kind of get away with your sizes. You can kind of go a little small, and it still will stretch. This is a, I mean, it's, it's bouncing right now. So if you are an 1820 like I am with, with, um, with Lane Bryant and you're getting a jersey fabric thing, you can probably do an 18. I'm, I, a 16 probably would have been a little bit too tight, but I probably could have done almost a 16. Honestly, because of how stretched this is, this really would have given for me. It really would have give. It really, really would have give. I'm, I'm short, so um, this came um, past my knee, um, and I am five two ish, um, and it was, a, it wasn't that long. It, so um, if you are taller than that, uh, I don't know how that's gonna work out, but it was not very, it wasn't super long, and I'm short. Um, it, it, well, no, it came further past my knees. I don't want to lie. It did come further past my knees. So it was a very, it's a good business link. <clears throat> then I got uh, the blazer. This is a menthol. It's how they, they describe it online. The menthol color. Um, um, blazer. This is a 22. This was big. A little bit too big. Um, a lot big, actually. Um, too big. Sucked really bad. I was like, oh, no. This was too big. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do because <laughs> I don't want to send it back. <laughs> I, that's, that's my issue with buying stuff online. Um, I'm, I might get this taken in as well. It just needs to be taken in on my side. So, like I said, I might make the investment, go ahead and get this stuff taken in, and then I'll know for future reference. Oh, and let me just show you the budding and paneling so you can get an idea of it. <clears throat> uh, has the two buttons there. And I got it to go over top of that, that dress. Um, the colors are beautiful for spring. Um, beautiful colors. Um, yeah. And I also got the peplum top. Um, this is black. This is fresh out of the pack, and I just got this stuff about an hour ago. Um, as soon as I got it, I said, oh, my God, I got to do the video. I try to do half something with my hair, like I'm wearing my pajama bottoms, and I just do this necklace on trying to make it look like I'm somebody. But, <laughs> no, nah, I was just sitting at home. Um, <clears throat> this has the... Peasant kind of, you know, collar, the Chinese collar. I don't know what it's called. I can't remember what it's called, but it had that little cute little collar on there. Um, this is, and this is the front. It came with a hot pink belt. I have a hot pink skirt that I thought this would be perfect for. Um, it's a jersey fabric. This is also a little bit big, but it came with a belt. So I believe that that's going to really work out really well. I think actually this is probably going to be the one that works the best for me. This is also, it's also, a jersey fabric. I don't think it said that online, but this is a jersey fabric as well. It's very stretchy. It gives really well. The problem with buying stuff online 
is the fact that um, it's online. You don't know. So what I my tip for buying anything online would be to um, would be to measure yourself, pay attention to the fabric, and try to buy stuff when they have the option of free shipping or pick those sites that have free shipping. Um, is what I would say. Um, I'm going to be doing some more online purchases for a couple of other dresses. Um, also, I want to talk about shipping. Um, I ordered this on May, March 31st. Today is April 15th. I received it today. It takes 10 business days. Literally, it came exactly 10 business days. So this did come from London. Um, so if you're wait, if you're needing it to be ready on time, it's not going to come early. It's going to come the time frame that it said. It took them literally the full 10 business days. Now, I was like, I was telling myself, if they didn't come today, I was going to call them and, you know, kind of be upset because I didn't spend a small amount of money. And I would have spent more, but I didn't know how everything was going to fit, and I didn't know how long it was going to take them to get it. So, <clears throat> overall, my experience would simply be is I give them, I give them a, um, I give them an A. I give them an A. I don't give them an A+. Plus. Um... I don't give them, I don't give them an A plus, I don't give them an A minus, I give them a straight A. Um, because the time frame that they told me on the website for it to come was true. And the reason why some of the things don't fit has nothing to do with them. That has to do with me. I didn't know. Um, I wish there were more things online that let us know what to do as big girls as far as fabric. That's a lot of the apprehension that I know I have with buying online. And there needs to be something that does something to let you know this fabric is going to give, this fabric's not. You know, we might have to do some more research, jersey, knit, those things give for us. You can go down a size. You can go true to size. You can go lower than your size, possibly, depending on how you're trying to look. Um, if you guys have any other questions about Simply Be, please give me a um, – drop a comment below. Um, and let me know, you guys, if you like these kind of videos. Um, I think I'm going to start buying more things online, so I think I'm going to start doing more reviews as it relates to these online purchases because – I know I was looking and scouring YouTube to try to find information on you on this this website and I couldn't find anyone who did a review on it. So I wanted to give you guys my honest feedback. I am pleased with the material. The quality is very good. Um from what the I purchased, like I said, I spent hundred and eighty four dollars on three items. So their items they're not you know, some of the sometimes they might have cheaper items, but if you spend money at Lane Bryant, then you'll be okay with buying stuff from Simply B. If you're more of a you know, that's too high because the dress, the blazer was like $90 or something, you know, it, you know, then, you know, you may not want to do it. Also, when they send it, stuff the stuff in, um, they did send, um, you know, the thank you for shopping with Simply V. And um, they did allow me to have 30% off my next order and free shipping again. So will I be taking advantage of that? Heck yeah, I will. I will be buying some more items offline. So. And now that I know what their um, items are or whatever, I, I will probably buy again. Um, I'm going to probably do some research on some tailoring and see if I can get the blazer, you know, pulled in a little bit um, and maybe leave the dress as is. Or I might try to find something else to go with the, with, the, with the dress. But I love the dress. It fits really pretty. It looks very cute on me. Um, I love the pebblum top. So I'm, I'm overall, I'm happy. Um, I hope this was answering some of you guys' questions. And thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please subscribe, um, and I'm going to probably start doing some more videos now that I finally figured out how to work this thing. Um, and thank you guys again uh, for watching. I appreciate it. I don't know how many views this is going to get, but hopefully this will be helpful for someone because I was looking for someone to do an honest review on Simply Be, and my experience is pretty good. Awesome. It just took forever, and I love to get stuff immediately, and, you know, I hated that I had to wait. But other than that, great, great website, great experience. Um, the fashions are phenom. Um, they're really pretty much on trend. If you look at all your in-style magazines, they have cute jumpsuits, blazers, pencil skirts, pretty dresses. Um, I'm going to be doing some other website online reviews um, from different websites as well. Um, I'm going to stop talking because I think I'm about 15 minutes and I don't want to talk that much. So I uh, thank you for watching. Y'all have a good day. Bye.